lady come up to me after the show, like, you know what? You had a rotten mouth. Your mouth was just so rotten. I'm like, oh, yeah? You got three teeth in your mouth. Whose mouth was really rotten around here? <laughs> no, but I've been traveling with a guy by the name of Cowboy Comedian. You know, he's a real cowboy. You know, he just cowboy hat, cowboy boots, and buckle. You know, just cowboy from Texas, you know? And me and him, we got close. We got real close. Not broke back mountain close, but close. <laughs> you know, I mean, he started sharing his problems with me, and I started doing the same. And I'm like, this is a cool dude right here. We got so close, Cowboy asked me a stupid right. question. A few months ago, he asked me to go hunt. Exactly, that's what I'm like, huh? <laughs> I know we close, but we ain't broke back mountain close, man. <laughs> I don't know if you know, but blacks, we just don't go in the woods. <laughs> Unless we're doing community service or running from one of y'all. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, you know, I trust Cowboy. I thought about going with him. You know, I'm like, Cowboy's a cool guy. He's a trophy hunter. He don't want nothing small. He only kill big things. But I've been around some of his relatives. Different models. <laughs> if it's brown, take it down. If it's black, it just don't come back. <laughs> <laughs> Last time I checked, I was black as hell. Only difference between me and midnight is 11.59. <laughs> I can honestly say I like to hang out with y'all because it's a lot safer. <laughs> no, I'm serious. I'm one of the scary black guys. I'm scared of black people too, okay? If I'm walking up the street and I see two black people coming my way, I'm across the street. I'm just trying to be frugal with my money, okay? I grew up on North Minneapolis. It's so ghetto over there, I seen somebody getting shot while he was getting shot. Think about it. What was I working out? Anybody? Here? There's a lot of things black people do that you guys just don't know about, you know? Like sometimes you guys ride around listening to Biggie and Tupac and look, look crazy and shit. And, you know, black people sitting there acting all cool. But when we be at home, we sing songs like, Hey there, Delilah. I'm like, I know that. I know that song. I know some Creed, too. The only reason why I know Creed is because I was locked up and that's the only thing that they played in there. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man, is the economy affecting y'all around here? Oh, yeah? Wow. Well, just you, I'll take it. Okay. I'm going to sell out of everything I got tonight. Okay. It's affecting me bad. Well, hell, shit, the economy ain't even... I've been broke. I ain't even go front. I've been broke as a child. I didn't have much, you know? My mom was creative, though. She didn't let nothing bring her down. You know, my mom got six kids. One Christmas, she bought us three presents and made us fight over them and said, whoever wins can have them. <laughs> and after I whooped everyone's ass, I said, Mother, why didn't Santa Claus come here? And she said, because we live in an apartment, we don't have a chimney, and plus he got stabbed before he made it. <laughs> Nobody could tell me nothing wrong about my mom. Nothing at all. Nothing. I don't care if she was in the wrong. She was right. So I found out she was lying to me. She come in the room, hey, hey, baby, you clean your room? Yeah, I clean my room. I need to talk to you. I'm like, okay, mom. I said, baby, I want you to know that you're so smart, they got to put you in special education. <laughs> I get in the classroom, there's a guy can't walk or talk, and I'm sitting next to Bush. I'm like, what the hell is this? <laughs> oh, we got Bush fans here. Okay, I'm sorry. I guess Obama's out the window, huh? Hey, don't worry, I didn't vote for him either. I'm trying to be rich in the next year or two, okay? Go here! I was joking. I voted for him. <laughs> you racist son of a bitch. I'm joking, man. You, <laughs> you know when, you want to know when Obama got elected, a lot of black people was acting a fool in North Minneapolis. Seriously, it tripped me out. Honestly, it really tripped me out to see my people acting crazy. I know you know you probably got some racist people in your family. Or